everybody this is Ernie Hatmaker and I want to try the premier earth friendly and now it's called um, paint roller plastic and it's supposed to be um, eco-friendly and basically it's supposed to disintegrate you know in the earth over a period of a few months once it you know contacts the dirt and water and all that so we're gonna see if that holds true in the garden Now back there, Ed is preparing um, a little spot where I would planted some flowers from a wildflower packet and it seemed like the only thing that came out of the wildflower packets was weeds. So um, we're just going to kind of knock those down a little bit and then we're going to roll this plastic over them, put some pallet beds out and in a couple of months I will look and show you whether or not this stuff has disintegrated. Let's see if they're telling us the truth. So a problem that we seem to be running into is that if you leave any vegetation down, it will just rip holes in it. So I'm not really sure that this is meant for uh, anything with vegetation like, like you can use landscape cloth or something like that. I don't think this is what that's meant for. Stems. Yeah, we have some some ragweed stems that are poking out and they are literally just pushing holes through Now I do believe because it's so I don't want to say weak, but um, it's very thin. Yeah, it's very thin um, eco plastic uh, I probably work on grass Anything with a stalk or a stem it's gonna poke right through it. As we've 